UAA, College of Business and Public Policy. Students should consider taking Alaska Native Business Management because understanding the Alaska Native business landscape is understanding the Alaska Native corporate model and the Alaska Native Claims Settlement Act. If you plan to live and work here, you will encounter an Alaska Native Corporation, be it a Native Corporation or a subsidiary of an Alaska Native Corporation. These students, both Native and non-Native alike, are learning this landscape in this program. It is, it is essential to their future success in living and working in Alaska. I chose to pursue Alaska Native Business Management to have a deeper understanding of our state and the businesses that really drive our state. And the opportunity to learn about that from the university here in Anchorage was um, an opportunity that I couldn't pass up. Growing up here in Alaska and specifically in Anchorage, um, if you look at the job market and what's available, uh, most of the work that you'll find either is directly for or indirectly with one of the Alaska Native corporations and uh, the regional corporations and some of the village corporations that are becoming pretty large. So uh, for me, it was a decision knowing that I wanted to stay in Alaska and work in the economy here. And so um, it was a natural fit. When I grew up in the village, I knew nothing about Alaska Native business or I didn't even know what INCSA was. So when I heard about the program, it just sparked my interest to understand like what it's actually about. So that's why I chose Alaska Native Business. I was able to, able to talk with uh, some of the board members within Chalista that I wasn't able to get a chance to uh, outside of the you know, normal like work day. Uh, these, these people are busy, um, everybody's busy, but when you're able to corral them into one class, one evening, I was able to actually talk with one of my own board members at Chalista and actually have a one-on-one -on -one conversation with him. Uh, so to me, it was, it was valuable to have that, uh, that time with him uh, because they are busy and they are between, they travel a lot. And so to actually have them there to ask questions and have, have a one-on-one -on -one was, uh, was valuable. The biggest things I, I took away from the program were the, the value that Alaska Native Corporations and Village Corporations and INCSA really um, had on the economy of our state and the impact that they have in the job market. Um, knowing that, that there's a, a home and a career for all of us who choose to pursue that is really valuable. Key items I took away from Alaska Native Business Management would be a general understanding of ANCSA and how it impacts the state and businesses throughout. Uh, the second would be how Alaska Native history and culture is incorporated within a business environment. And I believe the third would be is that how indirectly and directly Alaska Native corporations have such a huge impact on the general business environment throughout the state and in the lower 48 the importance of the Alaska Native businesses in Alaska and the value that they, the cultural values that they put in the business structure goes above and beyond just regular corporations where they have, like they do the seven night sharing and that nobody comprehends the importance of that unless you're in a Native business. I think the opportunity to network um, has followed me into my career and specific examples in our Inside the Boardroom class, we had the opportunity to present to 11 of the 12 board chairs for the regional corporations and that opportunity and exposure to those folks was something that I don't know where else you could find and to be able to have that dedicated amount of time to you know, present what we've been learning and studying in an actual board setting and having that experience academically has helped me now as I move forward today. In fact, we have 
board committee meetings that I just left that I was helping along with and um, that's the reality of my job now. I, I'm dealing with the board often and, and that was probably a highlight for me. One of the assignments that we had was to get in contact with the shareholder with the, um, the board of directors so I got in contact with um, a NANA board member and so that was my key networking and once the interview was over with her a few weeks later I got a call from Nana saying asking me if I wanted to be on the board of the Elders Trust. It's helped me give a better understanding of uh, when we go out to these villages uh, what I'm what we're doing out there for our, our people for our company uh, we're not only just helping them uh, we're helping them uh, through making revenues for the company which are uh, generating dividends for um, for the shareholders and it's just uh, it gives more opportunities uh, for the the people uh, within STG and for Chalista but as far as uh, STG Inc um, I've it's helped me uh, I've traveled all over the state I've been to Amonic, um, Bethel, Nome, uh, let's see Kivalina um, it just uh, kind of gave me a better idea on uh, what to expect when I was traveling out there uh, to the villages. I use the inks and knowledge every day in my life, um, in my job, in my interactions with my friends and family. I love to educate people, um, taking away what I've learned from the program and sharing, sharing that with my community has been really great. Uh, six of the credits in the Alaska Native Business Management Program um, are uh, Alaska Native Studies courses um, as a curricular partnership. Um, so some of the Alaska Native Studies courses, such as the Alaska Native Perspectives, it's, a, it, it's an introduction. Um, and it's an introductory course that really provides a really broad overview of not only the you know, like the historic history of Alaska, our diverse languages, our various culture groups, but it really includes the contemporary histories, um, the landmark 1971 Alaska Native Claim Settlement Act, um, and then also the, uh, the here we are in the 21st century and the, the role of Alaska Native people in, in, as we form um, new initiatives for the state of Alaska. And of course, our students are part of the, this wonderful future educated individuals that will be out in the workforce. I recommend Alaska Native Business Management because there's nothing else like it available and for me the amount of effort and time put in is totally worth way more than what, it, what is spent moving forward. The, the value is incredible. Um, the amount of knowledge received from the program that we can take and put back into our community is, is amazing and wonderful to share with others. I would recommend Alaska Native Business Management because that is the foundation for all Alaska Native corporations. Understanding INGSA gives you an understanding of how they operate, how they benefit all shareholders within the corporations how they give back to the communities and how all the shareholders and descendants of shareholders can help their communities. I testified before the UA Board Regents for Alaska Native uh, themed general ed requirement because I feel that Alaska Native history is something that needs to be talked about and that in order to learn from it in order to keep going and break down barriers. This is something that's very important and that it can help us all thrive going forward. I recommend Alaska Native Business Management because uh, if, you, if you don't have uh, any idea on uh, how uh, Alaska business is done, uh, this uh, management class uh, will give you a perspective on how everything's intertied, not only uh, with the corporations here in Anchorage, um, but they're just not here in Alaska, they're spread um, across the world. Visit us at business.uaa.alaska.edu.